Well, obviously, Jenny didn't claim the royalties. Why would she send a check to herself? Yeah, but you still don't know it was Charlie. Oh, who else is going to send an unemployed lesbian actress $100,000? I don't know Ellen DeGeneres. <laughs> I'm telling you, Charlie's alive. Oh, good. Then I don't have to tell you. Men, men, men. Man. Charlie is still alive? Yeah, kinda. What do you mean, kinda? Because she kinda drank when she was pregnant with me, and now I kinda can't do math. Hey! Hey, what are you still doing here? Oh, I accidentally fell asleep in Zippy's room. How do you accidentally fall asleep? You accidentally washed down your pain pills with scotch. <laughs> What's fatal attraction doing here? She says that Charlie is still alive. I knew it. <laughs> Alan, if you move out and Charlie stays here with Walden, I believe that we can keep this going for another five years. <laughs> yeah, I don't think so. <laughs> so, uh, what exactly happened to Charlie? Yeah, start from the beginning. You mean from the pilot? No. What happened to my brother after you married him? Oh, well, we had a wonderful wedding, and then we flew to Paris for our honeymoon. We were so happy, so animated. Uh -huh. We went up on the Eiffel Tower and went down on the Champs Elysees. Uh -huh. Afterwards, we celebrated our love with a romantic candlelit dinner at the Ritz. Oh. Of course, I've always known Charlie was no saint, but I thought marriage would change him. Huh? I was wrong. So wrong. <gasps> Disturbingly wrong. <laughs> I ran from the room, determined to never see him again. Charlie! He finally caught up with me at the train station, but all I could think about was revenge. But at the last second, fate intervened. So I booked us a cruise home. We moved into a brand new house in Sherman Oaks. The good part, south of the boulevard, where we could live as a happy couple. Wait a minute. You bought a house with a dungeon? And a pit? Of course not. I had it remodeled. The permit process was just a nightmare. Next time, use my pit guy. He's the best. Continue. For the next four years, we were the happiest we'd ever been. I'd feed him, bathe him, and of course, there was endless magical lovemaking. Then, a few days ago, the unthinkable happened. Somehow he managed to make a rope out of his bowling shirts and ran away, disappearing into the darkness. That's all, folks. 